So back in the 80s, when the cocaine did, money did start to flood into Miami. Mm -hmm. Did that have any impact on this? Did, did, nope. uh, no. It was still a dump? It was a dump. Yeah. People came here to die. That's why when the, in the documentary, uh, Edna Buchanan, who, by the way, at that time was an incredible reporter for the Miami Herald, and now she's a, an awesome author of you know, novels, uh, fiction. Uh, she wrote an article about the Miami um, coroner's office, mm. that they had so many bodies here that they had to keep them in a refrigerated uh, Burger King truck. You know, the Versace mansion. And, uh, and, and ideally, I mean, they were right, that's what they were doing, but they made it sound like there were so many people that were getting killed here because of the violence, that's the reason why they were overflowing. And that wasn't true, and it really irritated me, and I thought Adam Buchanan, and by the way, I really like her, and she's funny as heck, too, if you ever get a chance to listen to her do a, a book signing or something. Um, she didn't really tell the whole truth. 